guys happy stretch saturday this means a new stretching routine for you guys you know i love to stretch it out with you today we're going to focus on flexibility you will feel so much better in your body when you're flexible and i know our flexibility can get a pole either from working out too much or like sitting too long i just went to my aunt's house this weekend and i was sitting for three hours in the car and then sitting another i don't know how many hours there because the weather was so bad that we couldn't go outside and we just sat there and I could really feel it in my lower back. So really moving and stretching regularly, you will feel the difference in your body. All right, I always love to start in all fours to kind of loosen up my body, do a little cat cow, or just, you know, move around your hips, kind of get into your body and feel it. And you can actually do whatever feels good to you right now. You can do a cat cow pose, so inhale, move your belly towards the mat and exhale, extend your back towards the sky. And then you can also move your hip from side to side a little bit. Maybe circle your head. Do whatever feels good to you right now, what your body needs to, you know, loosen up and get ready for this full body stretch. And then next, meet me in a downward facing dog position and pedal your feet. This is really nice to get your calf muscles loose and the back of your legs. These can get really tight from sitting the entire day at the desk or from running or doing really weighted leg exercises. Mine are always really tight. You can also hold on one leg to get an even deeper calf stretch. And then switch sides, hold on the other leg. really stretch your hip up into the air to lengthen your spine take deep breath in and out and then come down on your knees and extend your hands a little bit forward so that you can come down with your chest it's a really nice upper back stretch I love this so much, especially if you're sitting a little bit weirdly on your desk and probably if you're like me with your head more towards your computer. And then slowly come back up again and meet me on the side. Your lower leg yeah, is kind of in an angle and then grab the toe of your upper leg and just extend it toward the sky and try to move it towards your head. It's really nice for the inner thighs but also for opening up your hips.
and switch sides. We're going to do the same on the other side. So come down onto your forearm and extend your right leg up to the sky and pull it towards your ear. Eventually you will be able to put it all the way behind your head but yeah this takes a lot of practice. I'm either nowhere near that but if you take a little time out of your day each day then you will make amazing progress. I always love to track my progress and see how much more flexible I've become. slowly bring it back down meet me in a cross leg position and grab your left elbow pull it behind your head it's really amazing for your tricep you can also lean to the side a little bit to stretch out the left side of your body even more And then switch sides. slowly release and then with your right hand grab your head and gently pull it to the side you can also extend your left arm a little bit for a deeper neck stretch you should really feel it here on the side of your neck you can also close your eyes get deeper into the stretch And then move your head a little bit to the front to target this area a little bit towards your back. And then slowly release and with the left hand Gently grab your head and move it toward the left side. And then again, move your head a little bit forward. And then gently release and come onto your knees. I show you from the side, clasp your hands behind your back like this and then move your shoulders away from your ears and open up your chest. You can 
Also lean back a little bit. This is an amazing chest opener. I do this almost every morning. It's so good. And one more deep inhale and exhale slowly release your hands and extend your legs forward bring your left foot or the sole of your left foot on your inner right inner thigh and then inhale lazy raise your arms towards the sky and exhale fold forward grab your feet and relax let everything go make sure you're extending from your hip not from your lower back this is gives your lower back time to stretch and lengthen inhale extend from your hip forward and exhale lower down Let your head just hang, no tension in your neck or jaw. And remember to engage your leg muscles, so to signal your body it can let go. This way it will allow you to stretch even deeper and get more flexibility. And with the next inhale, rise back up and switch sides. So your left leg extends forward, your right leg comes to your inner thigh. Inhale and exhale. Fold forward. It's totally normal that one leg is a little bit tighter than the other. And inhale rise back up and you know I always love to end my stretches with the butterfly pose because it's such a great hip opener so put the soles of your feet together you can grab your toes you can also flutter with your knees a little bit if you're still too tight in your hips or you can gently push your knees or legs towards the ground with your elbows and fold forward a little bit. And feel how with each inhale and deep exhale how your hips are loosening up little by little you can go deeper and deeper you feel softer more flexible this is your body thanking you 
that you're taking time for it and showing it the love it deserves. And you're done. Thank you so much for joining me for this stretching routine. I hope you're feeling so much more relaxed and flexible. So don't forget to subscribe and I can wait to work out with you soon. Bye. Mwah.